I've been thinking a bit about Bitcoin inheritance. If I had a seed hammer, what I could do is print onto some metal plates. By having the metal plates, you, know, you could just very easily scan, recover the Bitcoin. Much simpler than through some kind of complicated stuff that you don't need to know about. Yeah. What I'd like to do today is an experiment, which we've set up with seed hammer, where we've hidden three metal plates. So I've printed out a list of the three locations. You're going to need to install a wallet. You could use okay. any wallet that can scan these descriptors. So let's install that on your phone, and then we'll you know, see if we can find those metal plates and uh, you know, see if you can recover a seat. According to this paper, Moritz Castle would be the first one. Take Let's me go. there. What do you know about multisig? Well, multisig is when you uh, have keys and you basically give them to multiple people and when they all come together they can restore it, but it's okay if it gets lost or whatever because you have multiple and you only need like a certain amount. So this uh, test one that we're doing is what's called a two of three. You need at least two of the three metal plates in order to restore the Bitcoin. All right. Yeah, behind the camera. The corner. Got it. Ah. It's a security bag. Tear that open. Oh, got it. Yep. Okay. Recover existing and then QR codes. 28% is done. Scanned. Okay. Well, let's head off to the second location. So, next stop, Dresden City Center. Yep. Great, we're here. Found it. Got it. Cold storage. So done. Mm. Look at all that. Mm -hmm. 0 0.35 Bitcoin. That's a lot. Nicely done. So do you think you could do all of that without me? Yes, easily. Excellent. So seed hammers are great? Yes, definitely. Buy Good one. <laughs> Use the support link seedhammer.com Sam within 2023 and Seedhammer donates 5% of the sum directly into my cold storage. Yay! My dad held the camera and I did the editing with a little help. Find me on Twitter at twitter.com slash where I also posted the support link.